But that damn dead possum in her head has to go. Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to The Gaining Grounds. Before I begin this video, just a reminder, if you have not yet subscribed to this channel, please do so by clicking on the subscribe button down below. As you can see, my queen, Chantal aka Foodie Beauty, she's peeking through my shirt because she's kind of ashamed. The reason why she's ashamed of herself is because she just did a mukbang. Mary Brown's Spicy Fried Chicken and Big Mary Spicy Sandwich Mukbang. I don't know who the hell Mary is, I don't know who the hell Big Mary is, but Mary should be ashamed of herself for enabling this behavior. And I think that after eating the meal, Chantal, aka Foodie Beauty, was also a little ashamed. But I guess when the world is ending and the apocalypse is near, you might as well take yourself out instead of waiting for the rapture to do it for you. That's what I'm thinking is going on here. I don't know. So let's watch this video. It's not very long. I just don't think there's going to be much talking, verbalization, verbalizing, verbalacity. I think it's just going to be fried chicken, grease, lip smacking, and uh, feeder porn. So come along. Let's see where this takes us. We all know what's going to take us to the bowels of hell, but we always hope for the best. Let's go. She should redo her. She should redo her opening with like an end of the world apocalypse apocalypse theme. Like put empty store shelves up where she can't find food. Just have the pictures of that. Her running through supermarkets looking for food, and only thing that's left is tofu. Hello, foodie beauty. <laughs> hey guys. Hey, how are you? How are you? She still got that damn dead animal, and she's still wearing one too. Just kidding. The cat's cute. The cat's not dead, but that damn dead possum in her head has to go. Before we continue into this atrocious looking grease fest that I see in front of me, let's discuss the look. The wig, I don't understand it. Now, two of my subscribers came up with a really good theory that they, that they sent to me. They think she might have had a Britney circa 2007 or 2008 moment and shaved her head. I don't know. I'm excited to find out. I'm hoping she rips her wig off a la Kimberly from Merrill's Place. If y'all know what I'm talking about, yeah, you're welcome. If you don't, Google it. It's fantastic. Um, the shirt, I don't know how I feel about the shirt. I feel like I should be 10 years old and posing for a school photo in front of that shirt. Like, that shirt could be the new Olin Mills laser. Olin Mills, twice in one week. Call me for a sponsorship. The meal. This looks like a jacked up version of the Colonel. Is I don't know what Mary, I don't know who Mary Brown is or Mary. I'm assuming she's the Canadian version of the Colonel. Is she his wife? I don't know. Them fries look uh, burnt and crispy to hell. That sandwich just looks like a regular sandwich. And of course, she has, has the mac and cheese. And what's given me the most anxiety in this video is that tub of gravy. If she washes any of this down with that tub of gravy like she did for that KFC fart and mukbang, ooh, I'm going to die right here on camera. The plague won't need to take me out because Chantal, aka Foodie Beauty, will instead. Welcome back to another video. Look at the cat. He looks evil. And if you've ever watched Pet Cemetery, what was that cat's name? Winston or Church? Church. Church the cat back there. No, BBJ in the background. Um, she wants on the table. BB June. Oh, but no BBJ. <laughs> She's using the damn spoon again. She's licking wood. Ooh. You have to wait. Mm -mm. So guys, welcome, welcome. So today I'm trying something completely new. I just found out about this. I don't know. Maybe I've been living under a rock. I don't know. I don't believe there's any food you've never heard about. That's lie number one. But Mary Brown's... Oh, we didn't talk about her makeup. I was so obsessed with her shirt and dead animal on her head. Lips win. Uh, eyeliner win. Eyeshadow win. I'm going to give the whole makeup look a win today because I think she evenly applied the powder so she doesn't look as sweaty and out of breath today. I kind of enjoyed that. So her face is very well put together. If she had hair with volume instead of a dead Muppet on her head, I think that would have completed the look and made it look better. But the makeup from here to here and here to here is a total win. Everything else is a loss. Chicken. Chicken and taters. So these are wedge fries, uh, fried it's spicy fried chicken. I'm trying the Big Mary, which has pickles and hot sauce. It's like a big crunch burger. Like a Why? Chicken burger. It's not a burger, it's a chicken sandwich. They gave me some Louisiana. Chicken burgers are healthy. They're ground chicken formed in a patty and then you eat them. This is fried chicken between two pieces of bread. Stop, Chantal. Anna style sauce, some brown gravy, and oh, let's just. So I'm really excited, excited to try this. I've never had cold mac and cheese, macaroni and cheese salad. So let's try. It. I have a bit of a smaller spoon, okay, guys? 
It's cold. <laughs> Beauty, bye. And I don't want to say that I have a bit of a smaller spoon. No, that spoon is still a wooden monster spoon. You look like an idiot. Sorry for the Amber Reed uh, weigh-in moments. I had to put my dogs in quarantine. Mm. Anyways, back to what I was saying. She said that's cold mac and cheese. And then she talks about I got a little spoon. She looks so dumb right now with that stupid wooden spoon licking wood. Ugh. Look at her. Mm-hmm. No. No, that's... I call that... Pasta salad. That is not macaroni and cheese, if it's cold. It tastes like KFC macaroni salad. No. Which we have in here in Canada. You gonna try a wedge fry? Uh. The brown gravy? Who's Mary Brown? Can we talk about Mary Brown for a second? I'm gonna zoom in on that little picture of Mary Brown. Who the hell is she? Does that look like a woman who makes this kind of food? That looks like a woman who unsuccessfully ran for president in 2016, president of the United States. So I don't know what she's doing on that container, but I figured Mary Brown would be more plus size if she's serving up this garbage to people. And she don't got no Canadian maple leaf on her products, like every other Canadian product out there. So big loss for Mary Brown. Oh man, that's good. Mm. Did she run out of that Italian paper she stole from the local restaurant because she's eating directly on the uh, chopping block? Macaroni salad. Look at her. Mm. Look at her. The world is ending. Of sweetness. The world is ending, and Chantal, aka Footy Beauty, spins on. Uh, why does she keep putting the I cat up there? Oh, you think that was a feeder request? Could you trap your cat and keep him hostage behind your head while you eat crappy food with a wooden spoon? Do you think? Mm. No, it's so gross. Ah, it's probably good. Who am I kidding? It is probably good, but it's so dumb. Dumb's the word I want. Dumb. This is stupid. This whole meal is stupid. It's unnecessary and stupid. What is this now? Louisiana style hot sauce. I'm gonna try with Louisiana sauce. This video is only 14. Even What's the that? even the cats like, please stop, mom. The video is only 14 minutes long, which makes me wonder: like, is she mm. gonna finish all this that quickly, or does she choke and collapse, or does she just barf, or does she give up? I don't think it's giving up. Chantal, aka Foodie Beauty, never gives up. It's not spicy. Oh, you better call Big Mary. Mary ain't big. <laughs> Mary's got a pantsuit on, it's for God's though. sakes. Mary has a damn pantsuit on. Makes a good... <clears throat> has a little bit of a bite. All right. That stupid spoon. So Mary Brown was a real person. I think she's the C's. She originated in... She had apparently a really good recipe for Louisiana chicken. And she it originated in Newfoundland, Canada. She had a really good recipe for Louisiana chicken that she brought to Canada. Is this like the Canadian version of Popeyes? St. John's, Newfoundland. We'll try the chicken wing first here. I didn't even realize they were chicken wings until just now. I thought she had gravy, fake mac and cheese, wedges, and a sandwich. The woman's got chicken wings up there too. I, I, did, I thought when she... Oh yeah, oh yeah, spicy fried chicken, a Big Mary spicy sandwich. I just assumed it was all in the sandwich. No, I'm an idiot. She needed wings too, fried wings. Mm. Oh, Chantal, Chantal, Chantal. Look at her. She's going to suck that bone dry right for the feeders. Wooden spoons, dry bones, pussies behind her head. Nasty. That bread's getting soggy. Mm. She better hurry up. The chicken is really tender. It looks all dry and nasty to me. I don't think anything looks tender on that plate. Not, look at me saying plate. Stupid me. Not greasy. Like... I find KFC chicken. Oh yeah, that doesn't look greasy at all. Mm. It looks dry and greasy. The wedge fries are nice and tasty. Oh, it's just gross. But KFC can be... I think today makes the two-week anniversary of her revelation where she held the book up saying she didn't want to die young. Oh, how things have changed. You see at times. Popeyes is usually not too bad. The wooden spoon. So stupid. Who asks for Basically, this crap? A wooden spoon. I I can't wrap my head mm. around it. A wooden spoon. Is 
Is it because... Oh, I'm making another dirty connection. Is it because it looks so big in her hand? Oh, is that why? Where is she? Is that why, Chantal? Do they tell you to do that? Because it's like, oh, we want you to have big objects in your little hands. Oh, well, we all know those guys are dreaming. Uh, guys who think this is a turn-on do not have big objects. Dumb. I wish... I wish that cat would just rip that wig right off her head. Come on, BB June. <laughs> BB June, rip the wig off her head. The potatoes are here. Your, your, <laughs> this is all mine. Your potatoes are in that tiny box right there. Bye, BB. Oh, so there was like <clears throat> enough people out today. She went out again for food. I wanted to lick it, but thought better of it. <laughs> she went out again for food. Um, she went out again for food. She'd have been that damn dinosaur when the crater hit and all dinosaurs are running for their lives. She'd still be foraging for food. Like, literally, the dinosaurs would be dying left and right because the crater, the atmosphere, all that other stuff. And they would be Chantal the Brontosaurus still trying to figure out if she could find something in the trees that are left. <sighs> Rollerblading. Or at least they were being ac active. Walking, running, yeah. walking the dogs. Yeah. What did you do? I drove to Big Mary's. Uh, Mary Brown. <laughs> Whatever. Who cares? Big Mary. I'm going to call it Big Mary's. Beautiful day. Minus the whole apocalypse part. Hi, Sam. What? Is that the Beezer? Is that Beezer in <laughs> the other one? He said, get off here. Bees by her head so fast where her wig just flies off with them. Bees. Oh, Chantal, get out of my shirt. It's so dirty. So this is it, huh? Nothing else? I have to go attend to my cats. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. This is really great. I started filming as soon as I got home because I don't want the food to get cold. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. But <laughs> Chantel, Chantal world problems. Usually they like my 100% undivided attention when I get home. I don't believe that. Which is why they're beezing. I think the cats are thrilled when she comes in with food. They're like, oh, thank you. Thank you. We get a reprieve. <laughs> oh. No, Sam. <sighs> All over the food. Another wing. Fried chicken with a layer of fur. <laughs> I think she ate the bone there. I don't think... Oh, I think she ate the bone. Mm. No. If I'm going to eat fried chicken, I'm going to tell you where I'm going to get fried chicken from. I'm going to get fried chicken from Publix. And if y'all have never had fried chicken from Publix, y'all have never lived. Uh, Publix is a grocery store in the United States, for those of you who don't know. Best fried chicken you'll ever have. I keep petitioning them to sell chicken skins in a bucket. Just the chicken skin. The fried chicken skin. Because oh, I don't even want the meat. I just want the fried chicken skin. Buckets o skin. If you're watching Publix, do it. I will buy. Oh, I gotta take Chantal off. She's making me itch. She's like an STD. Oh, She's like an STD. Oh, you're making me itch. <laughs> oh, did I miss anything? Probably not. I've always been a white meat kind of person. Mm. That's, not what, that's not what BB said. Hey, I find it kind of dry. Like, I like the darker meat now. Because it's full of fat and cholesterol and it's delicious. I'm with you on that one, Chantal. Wait a few minutes. <clears throat> I don't know. This hot sauce is good. It's just not. I mean, I'm used to like. Putting sriracha on everything, so maybe that's why. Maybe. You like it? You've killed your mouth. It's not too greasy, eh? No. Yeah. There's BB in the side of the uh, side of the camera. Where you can't see him, and there's a gun pointed at him from under the table. It's not greasy, eh? No. Oh man, this is so exciting. 
so stupid. I'm really considering... What? Going on a 30-day diet? Starting to put out videos on my <clears throat> other channel that are not food related. I thought that was, because... a, thought that was a vlog channel. Well, I don't. What, what are the channel? What is she talking about now? Another YouTuber brought up a good point. Like, You could make more money. Oh, clean the corner of your mouth, please. Oh, thank if you. If you do too much mixed stuff on your channel, I can mess up the algorithm. Well, you don't mix it. What do you mean mix stuff? You don't mix anything. You do 95% Mark Bangs, 3% weight loss, and then 2% uh, revelation slash uh, apology tour. Mm, that's a good chicken burger. Like, they won't know where to place you, I guess, in the algorithm or something. I don't believe that. Um, I don't know. Maybe that's true, but she just, that's not why she's doing it. No, I don't believe that. Not only that, but. <clears throat> I find the constant, like, maybe the change in content also. What change in content? Confuses. Am I on the wrong channel? Some viewers. Am I on the wrong channel? Especially newer ones. What change of content? I mean, I have my foodie beauty gang who... Does she mean she wants a, a, a channel for every cycle? Is that what she means? She's going to have four channels? <laughs> She's always been here. I don't even know why it's called foodie beauty. I think you ate makeup one time three weeks ago the whole time I've been watching you. And well, watch me. <laughs> no matter what. <laughs> Which is nice. Uh-huh. Thank you. I need more channels. I think that 99% mukbangs and 1% of insanity but is ruining my algorithms. They always say... What do you think, Gating Ground? Try to have a main theme for your channel. Well, Chantal, aka Foodie Beauty, I think you are bad crazy. So... Oh man. I think I'd rather watch. You know when a channel goes off the air and it goes beep and you see the colors? They might not do that anymore. Back Maybe in the you day, you would see the colors beep. I think that eight hours of off air time was more exciting than these. I don't even know how many minutes it's been 12 minutes. <laughs> Go to my babies. Oh, I hate the, just the texture of that wooden spoon. And I was so glad to see other commenters say the same thing. I could feel it on my tongue and it freaks me out. So day. stupid. I mean, she plowed through this meal quick. Get this woman a tractor and a job on a farm. Mm. I guess it'd be a plow, What's not a mean? tractor. Eh, you know what I mean. Get her some farm machinery. And a job at a farm. She's very efficient. She's not overly Who killed all the chickens? And there's the new hire, Chantal, laying in a bed of feathers. It's spicy, but the skin is so good. Chantal, why did you kill all my chickens? The skin was so good. Not so greasy. Lies. And you already said that already. If you have nothing else to say, end the damn video. Oh, I gotta hit 10 minutes so you can put ads in the middle. Oh, her nails are a loss. I'm finding I'm actually noticing her nails this time. I haven't noticed the last couple of videos because she's actually kind of been talking and I've been a little engaged, but she's back to being boring as hell again, so I'll be able to notice. Those nails need to be nailified. <coughs> I, 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 isn't gravy for mashed potatoes usually? I don't She uses it for everything but and it stresses me out. Just seasoned nicely, you know? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So seasoned. All the sodiums. Call Amber Reed. I'm, I still can't get over... I love this macaroni salad. I can't get over... Oh, nasty, with her dirty mouth. I can't get over right. cold mac and cheese. That freaks me out. 
Put that away for later. What? what? <sighs> you have two bones and three wedges. What do you mean? What, 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 for later when? Five minutes? That was really good. <clears throat> Very delicious. Ridiculous. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Ridiculous. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Well, her and her pajama shirt and raggedy wig have pissed me off again. The last couple of videos were good. Um, I felt like she was actually keeping me engaged with conversation. And now she's right back to, I'm just going to eat, moan on camera, stare at you for a few minutes, and then end the video. At least she did it this time in under 15 minutes. So kudos to her for not dragging this out for 25 to 30 minutes like she has been. But I really don't want to stand a point of this video. Let's go over the wins and losses. The whole face was a win. I enjoyed the makeup. I enjoyed the lipstick, the eyes. I even enjoyed the powdery rouges that she had on, and it didn't make her look all sweaty and like devastated. Let's talk about the losses. That wig needs to go. She needs to either eat that wig or burn that wig or donate that wig to science. I am sick of that wig. That Olin Mills pajama shirt. It's a win because it's not the same shirt she's been wearing, but it's a loss because it's just a tragic looking shirt. But at least it's not my grandmother's curtains or that other Moulin Rouge Golden Corral mess she was wearing. So, yeah, there's not much else to say about this video. Shame on Mary Brown or Big Mary. Who is it? Big Mary for serving this kind of food to this woman. They need to just cut her off, not let her come to the drive-thru. The apocalypse is on. Shut down. Stop serving this garbage. And I need to understand why Mary Brown looks like she ran for president in 2016. So someone needs to get at me about that as well. And let me know if that's really what she looked like. Anyway, that's it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so by clicking the subscribe button down below. Click the bell next to it so you can be alerted every time I upload new content. Give this video a thumbs up. <coughs> Giving this video and others on my channel a thumbs up means you like my video. And we, oh, I don't love a little, a little shoulder thing, that flash dance, baby. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Here we go. Means I can't do it. Means you like my video. And if you like my video, my channel grows. And feel free to share this video on others on social media. I also have all my social media links down in the description below. You can follow me on all those platforms. And I also have a link to my Teespring store if you want to get one of my awesome mugs. So you can start every morning off with my mug and a mug. What better way to drink coffee? Someone else also uh, just gave me an idea for a new mug, which I think I'm going to do, but stay tuned for that design. Anyway, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for liking, and most of all, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Until next time.